implement cedar granular tank under the general settings put a preload time that's so you can do a stationary start augers will run for five seconds even when you're stationary under number one you should always have a on time to section location and an off time to select section location that's the timing from the metering auger to the manifold for all of our tanks enter one second you repeat the process for two three four and five now that we have all of our granular timings in from section location to the manifold we have to select what airstream we're going to run each auger into for today i'm going to take tank one and assign it to the fertilizer boom every time you move a downspout on a metering auger you have to come into the associated tank and change it to the associated run tank grouping if you're going to run one tank into another there's various groupings you can cycle through we're going to leave it split like it is today cedar granular drive setup under the general setting it says they're custom settings that's exactly what we want go to tank number one and now we have to know which metering auger we have on the end of each metering auger there is a stamp the stamp will have a 1x a 2x for a double flight an hx for a high output and an lo for a low output we have a high output on our tank one two a single flight three a double flight 2x four a single flight and five by default is low output that's in our small saddle tank 